Hello and welcome to 527. My name's Clay. Uh, this is our beautiful draw at One Coolamu Court, Mermaid Waters. Um, I'm just going to take you around and show you some of the gardening things we've done and some of the things we've done to the external of the home. Behind the camera is Joe, so say hello to Joe. Hi everyone. And um, yeah, I'm really excited to show you what we've been doing here. Okay, so, Clay, tell me out the front what you've done at the front here. Okay, so. Uh, we were very lucky, they wanted to put in some palm trees, so the, the property was basically landscaped with some white rocks around it, but it needed a bit more of a wow factor. So myself and the Enterprise team, our young landscaping apprentices, we installed these great big palm trees. So three of them, two out the front and one out the back to screen the neighbour's property. And they also did the plantings around the base. Yeah. Ready? Ready? This was a really great exercise, really enjoyed doing it and enjoyed working with the Enterprise team. Some of the skills they learned were ordering, uh, doing a risk assessment, so in particular underneath this palm tree, all the power runs to this house. So we had to get in a great big HVAC machine to suck out all the sand here so we could put this majestic palm tree in, I love it. Um, but yeah, it was a really good exercise. The, the young people learned all about ordering. Um, plan identification, planning, irrigation, laying turf. It was a great project. Fantastic. Okay, now before we go out to the backyard, show us a little bit. You did some projects in here as well. Yes, certainly. So the, the Enterprise and the Enterprise Trainer did our epoxy floor in here with a flake finish. They did a fantastic job. It's come up lovely. Uh, I think it's called Seashell. It looks really good. Um, so they did the epoxy, flaked, two coats are clear, and it's come up fantastic. It makes the garage look juicy, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, it's brought it up beautiful. Some of the other improvements we've done is we've installed solar on the roof here. Um, so you've got a solar system which will help with those energy bills, help bring the prices right down. Good stuff. Well, everyone looking for those savings, aren't they, Clay, in their, in their they wallet share? Are. This'll, um, this'll, yeah, give great savings. Uh, there's also the ability to remotely monitor this so you can see how your energy use is going. So it's a really good, product. Perfect. Okay, can you take us through the side gate, Clay? Certainly. So we've got a side gate here, lockable, pet safe. Oh, sorry, Jack. We've got our hose reel here so you can water all your plants out the front. Also your clothesline. A lot of people ask about clothesline. Now our brief was, because we've got these great big Calibon fences and these beautiful windows looking out, was to make it a bit of a jungle. So to try and hide the Calibon fence as much as possible. So we, we use things like these beautiful heliconias, um, rafus palms, canna, it's absolutely gorgeous. My favourite, the foxtail palm. So we've got a bedroom there looking out to these beautiful gardens. Coming around the back, we've got our air conditioning units. So we've got ducted air right throughout. Our large hot water system, Aquamax. And again, we've got all these kitchen windows that look out into the backyard and we've got this white colour bond fence so the brief was to make a jungle out here so you're looking at beautiful greenery and the guys have done a great job cleaning these golden canes and you i am yes i've got to be careful not to flick any branches on joe yeah please do and again we've got these beautiful feature windows that look out um, so again greenery behind them okay now the masterpiece tell us a little bit about this beautiful backyard clay so the backyard's come up absolutely beautiful again the brief was to sort of put in this big palm tree to hide the neighbors a little bit which we've done uh, that was a mammoth task getting this into position uh, but the guys did a fantastic job we've tried to hide the fence uh, by planning it up and making it look very tropical and we've even got a little water feature here so beautiful canna planted around it water feature there so if you want to get a 
koi fish or crayfish or just leave it as it is absolutely gorgeous And we've also got a little area here for later on if you want to put it include a fire pit uh, so you can put a fire pit here in the corner keep coming down the whole yard's irrigated um, irrigation systems here behind the pool filter all tucked away at the back and Joe, look at this beautiful pool and gorgeous outdoor entertaining area. Those glass doors all open up, as you'll see from your walkthroughs, and it's just fantastic. And Clay, just something to, to highlight, we, we keep all the furniture covered to keep everything, the elements off them. So yeah, we, we want to keep the elements off them. The afternoon sun, oops, sorry, Jeff. the afternoon sun comes down this way. So we just want to make sure it's all good for the winter when the winter arrives. Same with the barbecue, keep it all covered up and this yard is fully fenced, you'll have no troubles at all with your pets. They won't be able to get out. So tell us a little bit about your working with the young people and how that um, made you feel and you know what the importance of working with young people in your town. Well, it, it was a really good experience, Joe, and I've got to thank you for letting me do it. Um, the young apprentices, landscaping apprentices, we also worked with them at our Christmas home last year. They have just come so far, leaps and bounds ahead. When we first got them, um, their skills were very, very basic. And now, as they're going through their apprenticeship, you can just see the work they're doing and the quality of work they're doing. They get better and better every week. So um, it's been a real privilege to work with these guys, do some mentoring with them and help create these beautiful results. Fantastic. So, yeah. Well done, Clay. And, and what a great um, project you've completed. And it's certainly outstanding. And the lucky winner will certainly enjoy this yard. I, I love it. And um, yeah, if, if you don't love it, come and talk to me i'll help you out but yeah i think it's absolutely fantastic if you haven't already please buy a ticket uh, all money raised goes to the great things your town doing including powering kids helpline thank you very much for your time and uh, i hope you all enjoyed it